basically the xlookup function is just a way for you to look up a value in a table and then return the corresponding value for that first value. Um, so for example, here, we've got a simple table of just a you know, name and birthday. So you've got eight people um, with eight birthdays, which I've obviously made up. Um, and so if you want to find out the birthday for, you, know, you want to look up the birthday of David, and you just do X look up and then David, uh, and then you want to look it up in the name column, and then you want to find the value in the corresponding birthday column uh, and then that will give you the birthday which um, if you correct the format then that's third of march um, so that's a, probably the most simple use of xlookup um, the good thing about xlookup is that uh, this table can be ordered in a different way so if the birthday was on the left and you want to look up the name which is now on the right, then you can see like the formula still works totally fine. Uh, whereas in the past, if you use the VLOOKUP function, then you need the whole table, like you need to look up the first column of the table. You can't, um, you know, you can't look it up in this way. Um, and so that's, I guess that's one advantage of the XLOOKUP function. The other good thing about it is if you can't find the person's name, so I'll use uh, your name, uh, then what happens is you can specify something to return if you can't find whatever you're looking for, and then it will you know, do that. Um, so in the past, you might have gotten an error instead of um, this. Uh, and what it means is, you know, sometimes if you can't find something, then that's you, know, you might have a default value, you know, it might be a zero or something um, like that might be actually what you want to return when you can't find whatever allows you to do that. Um, yeah, and I guess there's some other features as well, but yeah, that's kind of the general, like a basic summary of the formula. How many points will you score by collecting? Okay, so it's just looking up um, yeah, looking up the symbols and returning the point value of these symbols. Um, so yeah, in in this question, uh, if you uh, if you got the dragon, then you get two thousand five hundred points because um, that's what it says here in the question table. Um, so I used an X lookup to just look up the symbol under the first column, which was the item column, and then return the number of points, um, which in that case was two thousand five hundred. Um, so you can see how I've just copied the formula across um, and that gives you the point value of all of these different items and then you find the final answer by summing up the points and there's a bit of an adjustment depending on how many gifts you got and reaching the finishing line and things like that so yeah.